Hello Geminis. This is your reading for the 4th through the 5th. <clears throat> this is a bonus reading actually because the first one I did I felt like it was something specific for maybe a few of you, okay? So there we have the Ace of Cups. Let's see. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Um, please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Look at that. Alright. Huh. Maybe some of you have realized that, you know, only you can make you happy okay um no one else here but a lot of you i feel like are like coming back into your power um standing in your element realizing something here um wanting to start over as i say that with the ace of wands under the bottom of the deck feeling very passionately about something leo scorpio energy there um becoming aware of yourself uh, aware of the things that make you happy okay being compassionate here. Six of Pentacles. Sharing your time and energy with, with someone. Other people in general. You know, doing what you feel is right. Taurus energy there. The Empress. Hmm. Maybe some of you guys are interested in an Aries. Uh, a Taurus. Libra energy. Um, somebody that you feel like, you know, you can be there with this person. This you can do. Settle down even, okay? Somebody that you see growth and abundance with. Or this is how you guys are feeling. Like, you know, you're new you. You feel good about yourself. You're starting new things um, with new people, taking care of your family. Everything is everything right now, is what I'm getting here. The Seven of Pentacles. Hmm. Hmm. But I get, for a lot of you, there's somebody that you guys are interested in here. Um, but you're not really sure if they feel the same way. I think that a lot of you are waiting on someone, maybe. Okay? I feel like a lot of you are single right now. And there's somebody in that you are interested in for sure let me pull another card here and see get the full story for this line yeah either this is somebody that you have kids with um, you share a history with even I feel like this is somebody that you share a history with that that you are you're trying to decide whether or not you know you want to be single remain single or whether or not you want to um, share your time your life with someone else here somebody that you already share history with somebody that you feel like is your soulmate that you've had um, you've spent a lot of time with had a lot of good times with a lot of good memories with here Okay, and I feel like this is after you guys have walked away from a situation or they have walked away from you here. Hmm. And I feel like, you know, this is definitely something that you are really focused on or you're leaning more towards like sharing, um, being in a relationship with someone else because what's up in the air is if you will remain single. If you will remain single and just continue to work on yourself here, there's something that you are, you know, you're realizing here that, yeah, you're good being single, but you know what? There's somebody out there that you are very much um, interested in and that you love, I feel. I think you're confused, not really confused, but you're wondering whether or not this person um, feels the same way or still feels the same way after this tower has hit. This is somebody that you guys broke up with, I feel, um, very suddenly. There's somebody that you guys broke up with very suddenly before in the past with. And I feel like there's something that you want to resurrect here with the sun and the tower mirroring each other. I feel like you guys want to bring this back. You want to rebuild this foundation here. Hmm, Scorpio energy there. Yeah, and offer your love to this person. Make an offer to date, um, get together. You know, yeah. 
this person is your wish fulfillment. I feel like you want to take a leap of faith with them. And that's what you're like deciding upon right now. It could be an Aries individual that you are thinking about as well. Um, here with the Empress and the Tower. Mars energy. Hmm. Yeah. I, I feel like a lot of you guys feel as though um, this person is your destiny. A lot of you are healing. You, like I, I think a lot of you have just like really truly um, have awakened to this connection with this individual. This is like this aha moment. This is like this aha moment. Like oh my gosh, you know they do. They really mean a lot to me. Maybe I didn't give as much as I could have before. I'm ready and I'm willing now. Okay, but can I do this? Can I really do this? Even though I feel like this is my soulmate, this is the person that I'm probably meant to be with here. Aquarius energy there. Nine of Swords. A lot of you are thinking very heavily about this. Um, you know, whether or not it's too late. You're going back and forth with it. Okay. And I think for most of you, it's whether or not it's too late. Okay. Whether or not this person has moved on from you. Whether they will be willing to, um, you know, <laughs> try to rebuild this tower with you. If they really feel like you are their destiny. If you are their soulmate. But I get that this person already knows. Because I get that they were giving their all before. Or trying to. Nobody's perfect. But, but I'm getting that, you know... This is somebody that's very supportive, very mothering. Um, they they like to, they be there. They're there for the people that they love. Even people that they don't really love, okay? This is like a champion for the underdog here is what I'm getting. Um, but a lot of you are thinking that maybe, you know, this is not going to happen. But of course, remember the Nine of Swords, that's not real, okay? It's your imagination running wild. So, I feel like, you know, this is a strong message for you, Gemini. This is the only card here that speaks Gemini, okay? Stop worrying, all right? Do what you feel in your heart. Do what you feel in your heart. Do what you feel with this Ace of Cups, okay? Whether it's to remain single or whether it's to be with this person. But there, there's a need for you to decide here because, see that owl in the window? That's the knowledge. You have it already. Okay, so use it, guys. All right, my Gemini, so that is what I have for you, and I will be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.